I'm Andrew with Baker's Gas and Welding Supply. Uh, we're here again today to do the unboxing of an EMP 235. Uh, we have a special guest with us, uh, John Mensch from ESOP. John, why don't you uh, go through what we're going to do with this today? Yeah, let's uh, let's get a, a box knife and cut into this thing and see what we can do. All right. So when we open up the package, what we're going to have in here, first couple things you're going to find is number one, you're going to find your ground clamp and your stick electrode holder, as well as a nice heavy duty ground. Um, another beautiful thing about this ground is it's got a copper um, a connection from the bottom to the top of the ground, so you get a nice solid connection on your workpiece. Good quality equipment. We'll set this over here for now. Thing we got. Next thing we got is our Victor flow meter and ultimately uh, uh, one of our better flow meters on the market. Uh, on top of that you're going to get a 10-foot uh, hose with it as well. And then inside the, the torch bag, we'll try to open this up so we can put it back together for somebody else. You're going to get your, uh, number one, your owner's manual. I'm sure everybody reads that. So there's your owner's manual for your torch. We give you a another um, liner as well, a 030, 035 liner that you can install in your gun when you wear out your other liner. That's pretty cool. Um, these also, you're going to get a set of a little consumable package. And this is just an accessory kit. It's going to have your diffuser. Uh, a couple of spare contact tips for uh, different wire diameters, and then a uh, gas nozzle replacement items. Let's get that torch out of here, see if you can pull it. It's a uh, zip tie. Then you get your uh, uh, Tweco Spraymaster 250 uh, MIG torch. Um, it comes with a nice standard Tweco uh, number four bayonet. You got a set of consumables in the front end as well, so you're all set to go, ready to weld right out of the box. Cool wire on the bottom too. Yeah, that's another beauty here that we do differently than a lot of our competitors. As well, actually throw a 10-pound spool of wire into the box, and this is a 035. This is our our Esob 035 OK Arista Rod 1250. Um, it's a, a great running wire. We actually, you guys offer it on Baker's website yeah. as an option. Website. Your uh, plug adapter. Yep, your 110 220 plug adapter. Okay. A beautiful little thing about this plug is it's not a special proprietary plug to us. You can, uh, if you ever lose or damage this thing, you can actually go to the hardware store and make one yourself. That's nice. So, uh, on top of that, consumables. We give you some sample electrode. We'll give you our Atomark um, 7018 Acclaim, and this is a, a wonderful running stick electrode. Uh, it's a H4 uh, designator on the, um, as you can see on the, on the electrode there. Um, this product runs very smooth. It's got an excellent restrike. A uh, very good product. We're also available on Baker's website. Yep. And I know this little bag of. Oh yeah. Let's you know. Let's open that thing and just kind of show everybody what's in there. You may have to. So, you know, one of the things that we found with our customers is they uh, had a little complaint about, hey, we don't have enough parts and consumables in here. So what we've done is we've given you all of the drive rolls that you're going to need with the machine. So you, we've got uh, a couple of cord wire drive rolls because this machine is uh, capable of uh, 200, 285 amps max output. Uh, it also has um, uh, the ability to get up to 30 volts. Wow. So, you know, you can pretty much run, you know, 045 flux yeah. core with no problem with yeah, this machine, yeah. which we'll do today in part two. So on top of that, we give you a couple of extra outlet guides, okay. a little measuring um, device. Oh, sorry. Here's our uh, material thickness gauge, um, a nice little device. It's got all your, all your material thicknesses on here to help you find how thick your material is before you start welding. John, can we uh, try that out? Can yeah. See what we're gonna weld yeah, let's take a look. Let's try. It. I got a piece of steel. Oh, here. Yeah. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. So uh, basically, a real simple device to use. You just take your your 
material and you try to find the thickness this one's going to be a tight fit because there's a little bit of mill scale on that uh, on that material but basically this is telling us that we are dealing with quarter inch material Very cool. and then if you look you go to the 5 16th side it's slightly bigger so so and uh, obviously you got 24 gauge all the way up to your uh, half inch material thickness. That's a that's a useful little tool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It is nice because you're you know when you're setting the thickness on Smart Mig, um, it's it there's no guesswork. We yeah. try to take it out of there. Yeah. So. Very cool. All right, now that we're all uh, set up and ready to weld, uh, thanks for watching the video. Uh, we appreciate it. Go to bakersgas.com. We're going to throw a promo code at you guys, uh, ESOB235, which will get you $5 off a $50 consumable order. And linked below in this video is all the consumables that this machine will take. And thanks again for watching. Um, really appreciate it. Thank you, Andrew. Yep.